Between Black Friday and Cyber Monday, shoppers are spending billions of dollars online. Yeah, state business leaders say these big shopping days are good opportunities to keep some of those dollars right here in Alabama. News 19 State Capitol reporter Manny Beer Temple has more on shopping local and avoiding scams this Cyber Monday. Shopping locally, even online, not only keeps more money in your community, but also can keep you safe from scams. You might think of Amazon or other large retailers on Cyber Monday, but many small businesses now sell online. They really learned how to be internet savvy during COVID. Rosemary Elabash with the Alabama chapter of the National Federation of Independent Business says when you shop local, 67 cents of that dollar stays local. It's also a plus to know exactly where your money is going. It really is important that you understand who you're dealing with. Very disheartening to see the amount of scams. Sadly, this is an opportunity for those who want to prey upon our most vulnerable. Attorney General Steve Marshall is alerting Alabamians to watch out for scams this holiday season. Never give out identifying information that when you receive solicitations, go back and confirm who it is that, that is reaching out and particularly on Giving Tuesday when we all want to be able to support those that are doing great things. Make sure that you validate that that charity truly is authentic and is going for the right reasons. Marshall says to check if a charity is legitimate, go to the AG's website where you'll find which ones are registered with the state. He says if you do have a scam to report, call the AG's office or reach out online to one of its consumer specialists to see whether any funds can be recovered. Now, holiday spending in Alabama this year is expected to hit about $18.75 billion, according to the Alabama Retail Association. Reporting in Montgomery, Maddie Beer Temple, News 19. It is also important to remember to watch out for fake websites and deals while shopping online. Law enforcement agencies say that if a deal seems too good to be true, it probably is.